Yes. There's only one answer.
such an inspirational number. Fuck that guy. Speaking of dead guys, this is our brandest newest one. This one is called Summerland. It's about necromancy. We got a bunch of them. Yeah. Any chance the vocals? Yeah. She's like, yeah, no shit, that's what feeds back so much. Back <laughs> ass! Thanks. Yeah, but what's the problem?
and gentlemen, we're going to give you a chance to determine what horrible cover song from the 1980s we play next out of a very limited number of choices. Doesn't that sound exciting? How come your mic works so much better than mine, Mr. Fancy Mike? Oh, I'm sorry, did I say something wrong? Okay, our first choice is Kiss Me Deadly. Oh, we're going to do a voice vote, by the way. So if you want to hear something, make a lot of noise. If you don't want to hear it, don't make any noise whatsoever. If you really don't want to hear it, clasp your hand tightly over your neighbor's mouth. With their consent, of course. Our first choice, and I'll run through the choice. Ooh. Hey, hey, hey. Our first choice is, uh, I lost my train of thought. Kiss Me Deadly by Lita Ford. Uh, don't clap yet. Eat a gourd, wind up. Our next choice is, uh, what is that thing again? We're, we're, I think we're alone now, the Tiffany version. Our third choice is Never Tear Us Apart by NXX. Our fourth choice is Take a Chance by ABBA. Wait, was that an 80s song even? Was it? Alright, who wants to hear uh, Kiss Me Death by Lena Ford? Would it help to know that she posed in Playboy at one point? She did. I had that issue. My dad had that issue and I found that issue. <laughs> Who wants to hear I Think We're Alone Now by Tiffany? That's good. That's a good one. We hardly ever screw that one up. Who wants to hear Never Tear Us Apart by NXS? No. Good. Ooh. I mean, that one's fine too. It's a true story that every time we play Ludington, they always pick that song. Only in Ludington, only ever. True story. Who wants to hear Take a Chance by ABBA? That one's highly, highly likely to be screwed up by yours. Live ABBA at the... I tell you what. Who knew? Tell you what. I think I think we're alone now in ABBA and it's high. Yeah. Oh, yeah. play Regals there, but I missed it. Just kidding. Yeah. 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 Oh, you want to hear where Eagles there, but I missed it? Hopefully, things go well. I can't have a feeling they're in Ready, Carnies? Yeah. 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 So we're gonna just as we can. Go, 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 go,
your two kids. It occurs to me that we have not created much of a mess tonight. That shall be remedied. Oh, the wheel of misfortune, you say. As we like to call it, the wheel of pie, for some reason. Raise your hand if you're a fan of the wheel of misfortune. Well, you've come to the right place, folks. What's that? <laughs> three, four, 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 three, four. We're gonna need a volunteer. First, you. Yes. Yes. I've gone off. Okay. Stop praying up. Stop praying up. Everyone. Before you do anything, I'm gonna show you what you could win. Last one. Go, Julie. It was the last one. Don't turn your light on the jacket. No. So if you want one like it, you can buy it. It was something fun. I know. Never I mean, okay, as you can see, our little wheel has a few few things in it. We've got sticker. Uh, we have buttons on this. Oh, we do have a button on this. I don't think I've, I didn't bring any buttons up front, so if you, uh, if you win a button, we'll give you one for the merch case. I just forgot to bring it. Now for stickers. For stickers, you get your choice. The common run-of-the-mill black Jack and the Carney sticker, which looks good, don't get me wrong. But the rare as hen's teeth coveted Dig a Hole sticker for our Dig a Hole song that we almost never play. <laughs> this one is in celebration of Jimmy Hoffman Day on July 30th. Very coveted. And of course, you get CD, you get our little EP. It's a seven song or however much is on there. Seven song. So it's a good EP. And of course, there's the pie. Okay, what's your name? What's your name? This is Emma, everybody. Give Emma a big round of applause. Did I mention that if you get pie, you get a pie in the face? All right, Emma, give it a big, give it a big spin. It's, well, you tried to load it, it didn't really work out, so it actually is kind of fair. We're just that incompetent. We can't even cheat well. volunteer up here and then we're gonna you know keep playing music. Alright, volunteer! You know the drill, you have your choice of uh, two stickers, the EP, or you can get a pie in the face. Alright, why don't you uh, tell everyone your name? Joey. This is Joey, everybody give Joey a big round of applause. Please send him all your negative vibes or whatever so he gets the pie. Or a sticker, whatever. Alright.
hamburger bound for you. Hope you liked it. How great he looks? Of course. Yeah, Joey looks great. It's like water off a duck. Alright. Anyway, that one goes out to two girls that tried to date simultaneously down in Orlando back in back in August. Souls go to God. That's hot. In a bad way. Alright, let's whip out our balls, everybody. This is what happens when you whip out your balls too soon. I would like Baba Yaga front and stage left. Thank you, Buttons. Jake and the Carnies. No, not Wally. <laughs> the most important member of the band, Bobby Gaga. A witch from Eastern European slash Western Asian folklore. Bobby Gaga was known for dispensing wisdom, eating children, and living in a hut with chicken feet on As you are no doubt aware, Volunteers for this one. Two volunteers, come up front. Step right up, step right up. We're not doing the bobbin thing yet, we will do the bobbin. Okay, okay, yeah. Save yourself for the bobbin thing. Two volunteers, come up. You. Yeah, you can do it. You volunteered for the pregame show, so you can still. Uh... Okay, good. That's perfect. Alright. I forgot your name already. Life. Everyone, this is Life, and this is Ren. Life and Ren, ladies and gentlemen, are going to be our two contestants. Life will get the blue balls, and purple, purple, purple also works. Yeah. Ren will get the, what, yellow, orange? Yeah, the fireballs. Blue balls versus fireballs. Alright, everyone clear a path. We want to make this somewhat plausibly fair. One step, big step back. All right, all right, all right, all right. That's our launch pit. Life and Rain both have three balls, as you can see, which is uh, not entirely unheard of. All right, Life. You go first. And whoever gets the most balls in a Bobby Yaga's mouth will win a sticker or a CD. That was one down. All right, Life. Oh, a purple one, no less. Closer than light. It's, it's not fair. All right, everyone. Uh, quiet, I guess. Oh, that's okay. So uh, you can at least uh, tie, possibly win. Okay, you can only tie. Come on, Rin. Sudden death? Nah. Okay. You both get a pie. Congratulations. This is great. Huh? Stay right here. Don't go anywhere. Everyone, let's hear it for our contestants, Life and Ray. Games coming up. 
I think they should pie each other, don't you? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's like a little wedding cake. Oh, here you go. Alright, gentle now, gentle. This is their first It's consensual.
set to two people now. One of them is Pitsy Pinwheel, who's off in Florida right now, because she loves this song. She always wears black chicken cards t-shirts on her Instagram. And if you wore black chicken cards uh, t-shirts on your Instagram, I dedicate it to you too. Alas, though, it also goes out to Heinrich 13 and the Devil Grass Pickers in Germany. And I'll try to make this story brief. Once upon a time, Black Jake and the Carnies toured Europe, Belgium, the Netherlands, and Germany. We uh, stayed with this band called Heinrich 13 and the Devil Grass Pickers. And we watched Lego snuff films in their basement and ate sausages, as is the custom in Germany. Lego jaw. Lego snuff films, that's what I said. Jaw. Anyway. We were also watching uh, old Andy Griffith shows and they played this song called Dooley, the Dillards did. So we were going to play that when they came to America to play the Muddy Roots Festival that we were also going to play. So we went home and we learned Dooley by the Dillards. The time came and they flew into America, to uh, Detroit, to uh, drive down from there to Tennessee. I'm not sure if they were going to stay with us. Anyway, long story short, too late. They, uh, they got to the immigration people, they opened up their merch case. Uh, people are talking, excuse me. Just kidding. And now I feel like an asshole, thanks a lot. Thanks for enforcing my will. Anyways, uh, yeah, immigration said, no, you can't come and play because they were selling, uh, yes, we're playing Dooley. They, uh, they were selling merch and they didn't have work pieces, so they banned them from America forever. So we have never played Dooley by the Dillers. You know Dooley? Oh, hell yeah. All right. I love Dooley. Yeah, I love Dooley. Well, this ought to make up for the, uh, the previous unpleasantness. Nobody threw up. No, this is for the thing. Yeah. Nope. Well, nobody threw up here. This is for the virgin sacrifice. So yeah. Coming up next. Anyway, this one goes out to Heinrich 13 and the Devil Grass Pickers. This one's called Dooley. Dooley! <laughs>
Buddy Valentine. Am I right? Well, time to meet your soulmate or something. Listen, I, I can't control what happens next. All I can tell you is the rules to this game. The rules to this game are I'm going to need two volunteers. Hi! Uh, what would you like to be called? Everyone, this is Charm. Give Charm a big round of applause. I'm going to need a second volunteer. Come on, somebody! Come on. You're waving your hand. Go to the Carnies cannot be held responsible for any sort of communicable disease that you get from the bloody apple drug. Right? <laughs> Please uh, uh, consent to my little waiver by hearing the sound of my voice. Good? How permanent? I don't know, that's between you guys. I didn't put any diseases in it. Only the diseases that you bring with you. What? Oh, is it dye? How permanent is the dye? I mean, you like? Once you die, you're dead. Yeah, okay. So this is not real blood, okay? It's fake blood, I know, I know. That's a lie, we just killed that asshole. The upside is it doesn't violate anyone's probation. The downside is it will stay in your face. So, the rule of the game is during the next song, you will all be bobbing for bloody apples. You will get blood all over your faces and various other things. Please place your apples in separate piles so they don't get confused. Yep, that's good. Because whoever gets the most apples at the end of the game wins their choice of sticker or that one EP that we get. You don't want the EP? Yeah, good idea. Oh, you don't have it? Wow! Shocked you! It's the old one. It's the old CD. Okay, you have all of them. Okay. Yeah, well. Guys, I'm gonna fucking kill you! Charm, have you ever uh, met Black Jake the Carnage before or played any contests with Black Jake the Carnage before? Not once, ladies and gentlemen. Over, right? Yeah. I feel like this is going to be over pretty soon, so we're going to do a fast song for this one. What are we doing? Wait, let's forget the set list for a second. This one is called All the Difference. It goes out to all the entertainers, all the musicians, all the jugglers. Yeah! Okay, everybody give our volunteers another big round of applause before they can't hear you anymore. When I start singing, you may start bobbing. I don't understand why that's funny. Who's singing? Oh, you want to do that? Alright. I'm going to remember how to play for a second. I was just like, I'm until I start singing. One, two, me and Kyle. Bye. Bye. 
Shall we? You're not allowed to put it back after you guys your mouth. Why the fuck is this so cold? Oh, I don't know. We had somebody else fill it up. It's been an unseasonably warm February. Bob and wind down. So cold. It's like my mother's heart. It's so cold. Oh, I thought the urinals would be like room temperature. Hey. Let's count them up. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Fourteen, and our man got two. Or possibly one. 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 Let's give it up for Charm, everybody. She really knows how to do that, Bob. You do have this, right? You have this one? Yeah, you do have that one. Okay. You want that sticker? Oh, that's a good one. That's a rare one. Yeah, I just found those. Oh, nice. Everyone give it up for Charm. She now has all the Black Jiggly Curtis merch. Do you have the golden shovel? I was like, she's kind of good. Do you have the, the actual golden shovel that's the prize in the room? And all the gold fashion way. Oh yeah, the rest of the party. This is a good one. Alright, you almost have all the black chicken and party. You still need the golden shovel. In my opinion. Put the little chair in the basket. Slipped. His wife long past and his kin don't ask to see the rest that kept them unforgived.
myself, I do not mind. So please, yeah, there you go. That's how it's played. Okay. You don't actually have to win them with anything. You can just throw balls at me. You want to know the secret to my confidence, everybody? I don't actually have that many balls. I figured out that when you're in Costume. When you're in some kind of a costume, you can like, be anybody you want. So we figured one little accessory can be your uh, sort of accessory of confidence. So I picked the least likely, the dumbest male accessory you could ever pick to be my article of confidence. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. Sock 
garters of confidence. I'm wearing the sock garters of confidence. I wear them at every show now. You want to see my sock garters of confidence? And you just put them on any 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 old casual men's socks. There you go. How's that, eh? Anything can go wrong on stage as long as I'm wearing my sock garters of confidence. They're pretty cheap. <laughs> I can't remember how much they were. They're on Amazon. You can. I expect you all to wear sock garters of confidence the next time you see it. I'm not gonna show you my shirt stays. My pants are too hard to get off. Alright! We're doing a uh, good man knows. There's far more than 35 balls there. I trust me. I buy them rather than runs. Buttons, do you mind not playing on this one?
with Curtis from Mitzlay, Michigan. This is our last number, and we would love it if you would sing along with us. Our closer. Is that me? Yep. Sorry. Hot mic. Hi, man. There. on this song, please. Help us end this with absolute chaos. If there's any more balloons backstage, I don't know if there are. Is there no? No more balloons. Okay, we're out of balloons. No more balloons. So we need everyone to chuck as many balls at me as you possibly can throughout this uh, next song. I've always wanted to visit more. And everyone should sing with us. It goes a little bit like this.
Change all 